Go ahead, take the ball, place it between your knees, bring your arms down at your side. Go back in tabletop. Now I want us to place our heels together in Pilates stance, shoulders down. We're gonna take the hips and roll back through the hips and then go back to starting position. So we're gonna exhale back and inhale. Just keep rolling through your spine and the hips. We're activating transverse abdominis, our deepest abdominal muscle. And we're breathing deep, relaxing our face, activating all the muscles in the core now. Last one. And hold, very nice. This time we're gonna go ahead, take the ball in the hands, keep the legs same position, bring the ball over the head. You're gonna do the same thing. The hips are gonna come back and the ball is going to move towards your legs. The progression would be you're gonna flex up and then lower down. Exhale and inhale. Heels staying together. Breathing through this. Mouth open. There's eight. Two more. And one more. Very nice. Let's place the ball down. Draw the knees in for a nice back stretch, shoulders down. If you want, rock a little bit over the hips, just side to side. This next exercise is called a single leg stretch. One hand on the outside of the ankle, one hand inside of the knee, one leg fully extended. You're going to alternate the legs one at a time. Modification would be legs are really, really tall towards the sky. And draw the knees back in. Shoulders down. We're gonna go through another set of single leg. Let's go ahead and set the hands up. Legs extend and let's begin. Inhale for two legs. Exhale for two legs. If you have any type of injury through the neck, you could take this little ball, place it back behind the head. It's just like perfect elevation for the cervical spine. Keep going through this. Inhale and exhale. There's eight. One more each leg. And draw the knees back in for a back stretch. Good, rock a little bit side to side. Inhale and exhale.